53 and 54, so on these we need to create a common denominator so we can cancel the fractions. So I first have to factor this. So I know x, x, b is negative 2, c, a times c is negative 15. So what multiplies giving me negative 15 as give me 2 is negative 5 and positive 3. So this becomes x minus 5, x plus 3. I didn't change the denominator, I just wrote it a different way. This is still the same fraction. Well, this has x minus 5, this has x minus 5, this is, has x plus 3. So this needs an x plus 3 to match. My LCD here is x minus 5, x plus 3. Therefore, my domain, x cannot equal what cancels a negative 5 is a positive 5. What cancels a positive 3 is negative 3. Okay, so this has both. This has both. This only has x plus 3, so it needs the x minus 5. Now they all have both. I did not have to change this one to have both. It already had both, so do not change the top. Once they match, we can cancel. And we get 2 times x is 2x. 2 times 5 is 10. 5 times x is 5x. 5 times negative 5 is negative 25 equals 16. So combine my like terms. So 7x minus 15 equals 16. So plus 15, plus 15, 7x equals 21. No, that's more than that. 28. Freeze. 20, 31. Sixteen plus fifteen is thirty-one. Mm, I did math wrong. Two times three is six. That's not a five. So then negative twenty-five plus six is negative nineteen. So add 19, and I get 16 plus 19 is 35. Sorry, though. Divide by 7, divide by 7, I get x equals 5. But x cannot equal 5, so this is no solution. So same concept here. This is a perfect square minus a perfect square x, x. 2, 2, so it becomes x minus 2, x plus 2. Again, I didn't change it. The negative already has both. This has x plus 2. It needs x minus 2. And bring up that negative so you don't forget about that minus, or the minus, so you don't forget about it. This says x minus 2. It needs x plus 2. So now they all three have both. And I get 4 times x is 4x. 4 times 2 is 8. Negative 2 times x is negative 2x. Negative 2 times negative 2 is positive 4 equals negative 8. Well, 4x minus 2x is 2x. 8 plus 4 is 12. Minus 12, minus 12. Get 2x equals negative 20. Divide by 2, divide by 2, I get x equals negative 10. But freeze, I need to find my domain. So I already know my LCD was x minus 2 x plus 2. So x cannot be negative 2 or positive 2. So x equals 10 is good.